Indians today as they celebrate Christmas Day. Sir Peter outlined the effects of COVID-19 and the challenges the pandemic has created for Kenyans. He has called on the government to give priority to the recovery of different sectors in the country. Let's listen in to what he had to say. COVID-19 recovery strategy here in Kenya, the negative impact of COVID-19 on the private sector has trickled down to the household welfare via reduced job opportunities and lower earnings. Unemployment has almost doubled compared to its pre-COVID levels. Wage workers, and especially women who are still unemployed, face a reduction in working hours and earnings. Almost one in three households run businesses are not operating currently, with revenues with re revenues decreasing across all sectors, remittances have fallen, and few households have benefited from direct cash assistance. Youth are also negatively affected by the pandemic, with revenues and profits strongly reduced for micro enterprises run by young entrepreneurs, with only few of them making use of government and non-governmental organization support programs. Pro prospects for achieving and fulfilling the original objectives of Kasi Kwavijana now look dim. The virus has affected all sectors of our economy. Many have lost lives, hopes, businesses, employment and opportunities have been lost. We commend Kenyans for heeding to the government protocols, hence reducing the infection rate. We condole with families that lost their loved ones. We wish them strength and the peace of God. We hope that the vaccine that has been produced by scientists will not only be financially accessible to the majority of our people, but promptly in order to reduce infection. As we move to the next phase and the new year, we call upon the government to give priority and direction to recovery of all sectors. We further call upon the government to continue to cushion the very poor in our midst. The health sector. The COVID-19 pandemic has really exposed the health sector. Although a lot of investment has been made in the infrastructure, the management expertise and leadership in the sector is essential as we move forward. The industrial unrest in the sector has dented the moral of the staff, the morale of the staff in the sector, and also destroyed the... And here in Nairobi, Katie.